Thank you, Mr. President, for giving me the floor. Welcome to our Minister of Finance and his entourage. Dear colleagues, good evening. Good evening. Mon cher collègue Esomba, vous nous appelez le palais de beaucoup de choses. Le palais à mon amant. Mais, 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 il s'agit de quoi? Il s'agit des débats d'orientation du budget. Budgetary orientation debate. Mr. President of the Senate, this is a Senate. And uh, the Senate is not any joking house. The yes. Senate is a serious house. And we cannot be called here, Mr. President, to talk about a debate on the orientation of our body. And then they call me at 6.30 p.m. today for a plenary. I am here now for a plenary. And they communicate me a document on the budgetary orientation debate. It's a debate, and a debate means that you must understand what you are talking about. And to understand what you are talking about, you have to prepare. We are talking about the life of this country, we are talking about the budget. And we are talking about the Northwest region, my constituency. I don't know the issue that have been raised here. I don't study this document. To be able to, de to defend my constituency. And uh, Mr. President, we are being guided here by the law, the Cameroon Code of Transparency and Good Governance. Government has exposed. An orientation of the budget for 2023 and the good governance. We are supposed, as a senator, to scrutinize, to look at what government has given, and to see whether it is good, and to make the debate with government. And the law is clear on it, Mr. President. If you look at section 13 of this law that I've quoted. It says, Parliament shall review the draft state budget and its implementation yearly. So to parliamentarians shall have the right to full information and communication on the aspects of the management of public funds. Public funds, and we know about the situation of public funds in this country. Nobody is a stranger to the fact that there is a lot of investment, a lot of corruption. Section 14, Mr. President, an annual calendar of the preparation of the state budget shall be prepared and published. Such calendar, or calendar shall, shall in particular provide for within a reasonable reasonable period to submissions of the draft financial bill. The publication by government of a report on economic assumptions, its middle, medium term budgetary guidelines and the priorities as well as fiscal options and the budgetary risk for the coming year. The report shall be debated in Parliament before it will be submitted this November during the budget session. 
So this is it here. This is the report. Mr. President, I'm moving that Parliament has been given enough time to study this, to confront the government and to see whether this document has been well prepared and so that is why I'm here to move for a suspension of this plenary so that Parliament should go, the Senate, look at this document, come back here and debate with government. That will be the best way for us to serve this nation. That will be the best way for, here for us to serve this country. The best way for us to show the international bodies that we are excelling and that we have to match align with the principles of democracy, with the principle of good governance, and with the principle of check and balances. That is the role of parliament. So I move that we should be given two days minimum to go and look at this document before we come here to debate with the minister. Your Honor, Your President, this is my humble submission. Thank you. Thank you very much.